Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E. He the reason you see. You throw a mother concert in louisiana and don't book no louisiana legends and put no bankroll in no louisiana legends pocket but you pay the police a half a million dollars what type of is that you ain't with my city nigga. you taking advantage of my city because it's cheap and, and, and it costs way less than it costs where you from and y'all stupid slow motherfuckers so crazy that y'all gonna let this nigga come down here and die, not show no love to louisiana I ain't book no Louisiana artist. This ain't book Big Papa. This ain't book Be Will. This ain't book Hurricane. This nigga didn't even go to Baton Rouge and get no no boosies or nothing, no webbies. Like, he didn't f with us. He came to take advantage of us. Shreveport had cheap ass land. He came and bought that and a nigga don't give a f about f with us. And he just showed you that by paying the police a half a million dollars when we got young niggas out here starving. When we got young niggas out here killing each other. That fucking money could have went to anything that helped the mother youth we don't need more money invested into the police we need more motherfucking money invested into the community we need motherfuckers who know the community who know the people who willing to put their motherfucking feet on the ground to make a difference with their influence your money we don't care nothing about it you think these white people ain't been having no motherfucking money in louisiana they using you to come through this motherfucker and to pay the city up they finna use you to rebuild the roads they not finna use you to help the youth louisiana give a fuck about jail Wow, man, what the heck is going on, man? What the, hey, man, what is going on, man? Listen, man, stop, man. Hurricane Kristen came out, slammed uh, 50 Cent for what he's doing down there in Shreveport. Lunell was mad yesterday. This is crazy, man. Like, I thought it was a good move, man. I hadn't really heard from Hurricane Chris since he beat that case or, you know, but the thing I can say is, man, I feel bad for him not being invited because he is a person that represents that Shreveport, man. And there's a lot of us from down there. Like, I'm from down on the Texas side, but I'm like 20 miles away, as I always say, on the Texas side. But the thing you got to realize is, man, uh, you got a lot of people down there who ain't, they ain't trying to hear that, bro. Like, like. I get it. He said they didn't, he didn't invite no Louisiana artists, not even BR. All I'm saying is I don't know who 50 invited I don't, I don't know if he paid the police a half a million dollars. I really don't. I just know that whatever the case may be, man, I hope they can figure it out. Because in my mind, I'm thinking it's going to bring more people to the city, more money to the city. I thought it was going to really do some things to change the narrative and make things to where people down there can afford opportunity, bring some actors, actresses in. Uh, Hurricane Chris, man, I'd like to see you in one of them uh one of them episodes from down there in Shreveport, man, that opportunity there. I hope that this didn't really mess that up for you. You know, hopefully there'll be other events. I Maybe 50's planning something else. I just know he brought Bubba Dub down there, which Bubba Dub is straight out of not even, not even an hour away from there. So he was, he definitely dealt with some of the people that he knew to deal with in that area. Now, I don't know why he missed certain artists that, Hurricane Chris is referring to, but I do know that Hurricane Chris is a native. I do know he had Bebe down there with him as well, which those are things that I think Bebe would have been the one to coordinate or figure that out. I would think that would be the way that would go. That Bebe, because he's so tapped in with the radio station, was there other radio announcers out there? Who all was out there? Because I'm pretty sure somebody from Shreveport that represent that city was out there. So 50 Cent, I know he don't know everybody that sent Shreveport to even reach out to certain people, but I do know that he he would expect Bebe and people that he did rub elbows with to, to make that happen. I do know that there was people from Texas right there on that Texas side from Longview, uh, from NAC, from uh, Texarkana, uh, all those people surrounded, Jefferson, Marshall, those people came pouring in the Shreveport. Uh, shout out to Mama Scott. I know she was down there. It was all, you know, I had a setup down there. I just didn't get to go. Shout out to Mama Scott again. Like I said, I just, I knew our people were down there. So I was proud of the movement. I didn't know that Hurricane Chris didn't get invited, man. I'm trying to figure out, damn, 50, you didn't invite Hurricane Chris or one of them dudes from down there. I'm trying to figure out nobody playing the celebrity basketball game. I seen the baby, so I know he was down there. There was a lot of afforded opportunity down there. I wonder if Hurricane Chris even went down there. You know, that's another thing, man. I, if you come to the, to the city, uh, I'm pulling up on you. 
So that's another thing. I don't know if Hurricane Chris pulled up on him or reached out to him or what. I'd like to hear more details on that because, like I said, I know for a fact that uh, there's going to be some afforded opportunity down there with all the building and designing going on. There's already afforded opportunity. I'm pretty sure contractors from the area, I'm pretty sure builders from the area. I don't think an outside source is doing all the things that is going to resort to building up that area for him to do his production down there. So I just think there's a lot more time, a lot more things, a lot more coins that got to be turned over. I really feel like, you know, when you look at Hurricane Chris, one of the dopest artists from down there, hands down, uh, 50 Cent, you know, he a patriarch when it comes down to where he from. And he got it right. Now, I agree with Hurricane Chris. He did come down there because the real estate is a lot cheaper, and, and you can't blame him. But people like Shaq and all of them do it, man. It's a litany of people. Drake just did it in Houston. These guys are all pulling up because they're getting a better deal on the real estate. I got partners that's done move here. Sold a million dollar home, bought a million dollar home down here. Not even a million dollars, maybe five, six hundred uh, thousand dollars. It's way bigger than what they had up there in the East and West Coast. My cousin lived in Mar Manhattan, uh, moved up there. Uh, was living in a million dollar home that wasn't even a good 3,000 square feet. It was very, very small. So it's a lot of opportunity down here. It's a lot of time these guys come down here. I have respect for the hustle. So I go up there. I'm in New York and, and I know Hurricane Chris. You just did like Matt Hoffa and some most stuff. So I know you be all around too. We ain't going to play no game. We all traveling. We see what's going on. So I know he understands the demographics and what happened. So he understand that it's a it's an opportunity for 50 to come down and really you know invest his time and interest into what's going on in these inner cities down in uh like the 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 shreveport area the boja area so i think that's a i think that's something that goes without saying um what would hurricane chris what you gonna hit him with you wasn't gonna say that a bay bay over there i know bay bay was there I, you know you were gonna rock that a bay bay for him or something was it a concert or something what was it that 50 did i know some, there were some performances there were some comedians there i just don't really know the whole just of how many people came and what was the whole i know they had a celebrity basketball game from what i could see uh gilly wallow all them boys pulled up um I think Cameron was there, I mean, I don't know if Mace was there, but it was just a lot going on, man. And you could see everybody was happy, man. I hate they left Chris out of that thing, man. Cause Hurricane Chris, like I said, that's he a dope dude. He in that, that, that hey, listen, I, I'm me, we all from that area down there. I'm not from Shreveport, I'm from the Texas side, but I felt Chris when he said, give him an opportunity. But then I also have to further investigate and say, did he give certain people an opportunity? You know, uh, like I said, Bebe was there. He would be able to answer that question. Um, it, uh, shoot, man, Bubba Dub was there. I gotta call Bubba Dub in a minute. Now, you done made me have to, I better have to call Bubba Dub. Bubba Dub, what the hell happened down there? Y'all niggas ain't, ain't called Hurricane Chris. But now nah, Bubba Dub, like I said, Bubba Dub on that comedy. I know he killed the comedy. I think Dave Chappelle. It, it was some people down there, man. Cat Williams. I mean, they had it going on down there, man. I just, I, I, like I said, I couldn't make it because I just had other other plans and I had planned on going there, but I just decided not to go. But I definitely enjoyed the fact that they was doing it. I really was more upset because I wanted to go fishing. Let's just be real for a minute. I wanted to go fishing. I wanted to go down on the, uh, on the golf course and throw my old reeling rod out there for a few times. And said, uh, I wasn't even going to get it on the boat. I was going to fish from the bank. So I want, I really want to go fishing, but I didn't go fishing. I got to call my boy Trill Talk, no pill talk, and see if he went down there. I just know I didn't go down there. So now I'm like, damn, I thought Hurricane Chris was down there. I don't know. I got to go do me some more investigating on this thing, man. But, man, get in the comments. Is Hurricane Chris wrong for calling 50 Cent out? Or is he on point for this one? Uh, 50, Cent, uh, 50 Cent invited Bebe. He invited uh, a lot of other people, too. But I just know Bebe and Bubba Dub was from down, down there and around those surrounding areas. Let me know, did 50 Cent pull a wrong move by not bringing Hurricane Chris? You know, Lunell spoke yesterday. Just let me know what you think, man. Get in the comments. Don't hesitate. And make sure you guys keep watching, man. Dropping more fly content today. It's going down, man. Boss Talk 101, man. What a boss's talk. Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E-Heat, a reason you see me.